Today, we will show you how to create guidance lines with your Ag Leader Edge display. We will start out by going to the Run screen, followed by the Map Options button. From here, we will choose New Pattern. Ag Leader offers six different pattern types to choose from. We will start with Straight AB, a guidance line based on an A point and a B point. Next is use A plus Heading. This gives us the ability to choose an A point plus a heading of travel. The pivot pattern is a circle pattern based on driving around a pivot. Adaptive curve is based on last pass guidance. Identical curve is based on original pass guidance. Today, we'll show you Smart Path. Choose the Smart Path pattern and press the green check mark. This will bring us back to the run screen. From here, I will turn coverage logging on and begin driving. After driving a short distance, I will be able to turn 180 degrees and automatically create a guidance line. This guidance line is usable for manual guidance or with automatic steering. Now we will go back to the Map Options button. From here, we will go to A-B. This will bring us to the AB Manager. Smart Path gives us the ability to create AB patterns within Smart Path. We will go ahead and press New. This will bring up the A button on the screen. After pressing the A button, we will have to drive approximately 160 feet before we will be able to choose the B button. Once B is selected, the AB line will be created. This AB line will be able to be saved within SmartPath. Now I will show you some of the SmartPath options. The top button on the screen, on the left hand side, is used to toggle between smart path lines and AB lines. The middle button on the left hand side of the screen is the cycle patterns button. This gives you the ability to cycle between active patterns on the screen. Now we will go back to the map options button, followed by options and smart. This brings us to our smart path options screen. Within this screen, we have the ability to choose path generation based on logged area, which means that coverage logging needs to be turned on, or all covered area, which means that you can create guidance lines without coverage logging turned on. Lastly, we will talk about heading threshold. Heading threshold determines what patterns will be visible on the screen based on the heading you choose from the nose of the tractor.